Hey, 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 everyone. Come on in, come on in. How are we doing today? Juliana is here again. All right, guys, class is in session, and I want to make we talk about something today called hepatitis. Yes, so I know, say, a lot of us, we they hear hepatitis and we know what it is, but for the most part, the one that we know, now hepatitis A, because why? That is the one that is most prevalent in some of our countries but today i want us to talk about the different types of hepatitis and what causes it and how we can know that we've got it all right guys so we talk about hepatitis what actually is hepatitis you know hepatitis is the inflammation of the liver yes so when the liver is inflamed that means it has been invaded by a foreign object it has been invaded by a foreign particle it has been invaded by a foreign organism yes so anyway so hepatitis a is caused by the hepatitis a virus and this one right here guys is because of unsanitary conditions let's say it is transferred from somebody that has it already maybe poor sanitary condition they're selling food to you they're not washing their hands or you've gone and drank water from a contaminated source yes so like the river and all of that and it has been infected you can get it from there like i saw a lady that they showed us that was selling vegetable and this lady was washing it in the gutter let's say if that's got that get contamination somebody that buys a vegetable or fruit from her and eats it without washing it real good we get infected yes so that is hepatitis a is because of insanitary dirty conditions caused by hepatitis a virus okay contaminated food and water we talk about the hepatitis b we know say this one right here is caused also by the hepatitis b virus and it is prevented by a vaccination so guys if you do work for hospital they advise you to get this hepatitis b virus because the thing no get cure but it can be prevented so how do you get hepatitis b you get it through exposure to contaminated body flus yes that is the only way you could forget them all right and so we talk about another one is the hepatitis c what is a hepatitis c virus this one right here is caused by hepatitis c virus it is spread the same way as hepatitis b which is body fluid okay so contaminated body fluid sharing needles and all of that this one right here can be treated but the treatment trust me is not cheap so it's better we don't get it than to get it into sort treatment now i have hepatitis how do i know i have hepatitis all of a sudden your urine is so dark when you pee is really dark you begin to lose weight and you don't understand why you're losing weight all of a sudden your skin is turning yellow your eye is turning yellow you are always tired you feel like you want to throw up all the time yes so i won't go throw up yeah then your stomach they hurt your joints everything they hurt you know why it you get poor appetite yes so that is how to say maybe it's hepatitis maybe it's not that is the time to go and sort after the doctor to make sure that you are okay so the doctor will have to run some tests and based on the type that has caused it sort a treatment that will help you to get well all right all right remember hepatitis a is because of our sanitary places that we eat in or what we do when we go use the bathroom and we don't wash our hands hepatitis b and c is because of fluid and this one right here can only be prevented if we don't come in contact with such flus all right god bless you guys please if you feel sick for any reason always seek medical help it helps a lot god bless you see you later bye